Welcome to the CyberMyLo Galaxy overview video. Galaxy has a set of 11 data display components for the Adobe Flex 3 and Air platforms, meant to be used by developers to create custom applications. We deliver installers for the Windows, Mac, and Linux operating systems. Galaxy is available both in English and Japanese and can be localized to any other language. Before we look at features, let me cover important information. LXA is a commercial grade set of components, field tested by thousands of projects. It's close integrated with Flex Builder, including simple UI creation with components drag and drop, property editing, library source code access on control click, and F1 contextual help. It's also shared with a set of ready made samples available in source code and commented for you to jumpstart your developments. More samples are available from our blog at blogs.ilog.com slash elixir. We also have a free support forum monitored by R&D that provide fast and accurate answers even for evaluators. Now let's have a look at the features starting with the 3D charts. They were designed to be as close as possible to the Adobe 2D charts for two major reasons. First, it helps you be productive more quickly, just change few NXML tags and migrate your display from 2D to 3D. Second, you can leverage all Adobe 2D Charts features as animations or live data updates, for instance. We created a true 3D engine with camera placement and lighting. Since the engine is crafted only for 3D Charts display, it provides small file size and high performance. Concerning scalability, for displays where the end user will manipulate the chart to make it rotate, for instance, it can typically handle up to 300 data points. If the end user will look at static charts, you can easily scale up to a few thousand data points. Note that for larger data sets, you would have to subsample before passing them onto our 3D chart engine. Let's have a look at the gauges. The use case that drove their development were business intelligence, reporting displays, or business dashboards, both for data display and data input scenarios. It ships with 21 ready-made gauges, integrated with Flex Builder for easy drag-and-drop GUI creation. The core value of Elixir gauges is their framework. It makes custom gauge creation a breeze. We'll now have a look at the vector maps. The requirement was here again dashboards and BI reporting displays. This module displays vector maps you can color code according to custom data, stock levels or product revenues. You can also overlay any flex object as charts or labels either by locations Texas, France or China or by geographic position in longitude and latitude. As for gauges, which we ship some ready-made maps, but the core value lies in the custom map converter. Let me explain. With Elixir, you can transform any map in Ezra shape format you downloaded or purchased into a Flex component. In other words, you are not limited to the maps we provide, you can create your own custom maps. In that transformation process, there is a simplification step that shrinks the map size while keeping its appearance for faster downloads and more efficient animations. Let's now have a look at the heat maps. Heat maps are also often used in business dashboards, BI and reporting applications to display how data is spread across regions, either map or physical areas as web pages clicks for instance. Elixir supports both cases, working either in XY or low lat and adds another dimension. You can display either data density, how many you have here or there, or data values as weather forecasts or prospect incomes for instance. Let's now have a look at the radar charts. Also named spider, web charts or keyboard graphs, they are often used in dashboards to display in a very compact way unrelated data on a given item, as location energy consumed, stock levels and employee productivity for instance. One neat feature is the declutter data tips and rollover when your display has many closed data points. As any other Elixir modules, it's compliant with flex habits, so it supports animation for instance. 
We now see the fixed module, the calendar. Elixir Ship, the calendar display, you can embed and extend to create applications that are Outlook or Google Calendar frontends. It supports five different default views, day, week, work week, month, and custom duration, from two days up to six weeks. It can handle both one-time and recurrent events with description based on the ICAL standard to make information exchange easier. Additionally, it supports multiple schedules so you can create multi-user, personal and professional events tracking display. It also provides multiple simultaneous events display and events that span multiple days and finally support direct map interactions for start and end time editing. The next module is the Gantt resource chart. This display shows what your resources as employees, trucks, and factories do and when. It supports direct editing and is nicely animated. We will now see the complementary module, again task chart. This display is used for project management displays on our MS project to see what is to be done, when, and by whom. Let's now have a look at the org chart. Our objective here was to help you design and deliver appealing corporate portals with intuitive navigation into employee structures. It ships both with a global view to see all of your employees at once and a local view to navigate from close to close. You can either use the default displays we provide or easily create your custom ones using custom item renderers for instance. The next provided feature are the tree maps. There are efficient 2D charts display designed to visualize mass amount of data at once and visually detect trends and appliers. It provides a direct manipulation to create custom coloring and clustering, as well as drill down to help navigate in your datasets and understand what's going on. The last feature we we'll look at are the pivot charts. They are often compared to Excel pivot charts but they also support multiple charts clusters. This module was designed to build interactive dashboard and data exploration display to represent and analyze data from multiple points of view using clustering and drill down. Elixir pivot charts are built on Adobe Flex OLAP interfaces and offer same APIs as the Flex OLAP data grid for easy upgrades. The difference between the OLAP and the pivot chart is that the latter supports and use interactive clustering and drill down. Elixir is available as free trials, fully functional and documented, which have three limitations. They are valid for 60 days, they are watermarked, and the library source code is not provided. Once you purchase, you will get another installer. Please have a look at the installation video for more details. I hope this short video helped you get more familiar with Elixir. Feel free to download the trial and use other resources as the blog with additional samples, the forum for help and support, and a public base of wishes and bugs.